Hi, I'm David, and this video is all about Christmas light painting. So, I live in a very friendly village, and this cottage behind me has been kindly donated temporarily by one of our residents so that I can do some festive light painting. So you'll have to forgive me if you can hear any noise on the road that's right next to us right now. And hopefully those car lights that are passing won't interfere with what we're gonna to do today. So I'm gonna be using the live composite feature on my Olympus EM1 Mark II. And I'm gonna be using a torch and some light painting tools to make things look really, really festive. So I'm going to show you the quick setup and something like this is going to be the same settings wherever you are because ultimately what you want to start with is a blank canvas. So I'm going to set my camera so that everything behind me is completely dark and then I'm going to light it up. Have a little look at these menu settings now. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is get our cameras into live composite. Now if you're on an EM1 Mark III, an EM5 Mark III or an EM1X, you've got a beef of bulb mode on the top dial which will take you straight to the long exposure settings. Now I'm using an EM1 Mark II, so I need to go to manual mode and then slow the shutter speed by rotating the rear dial all the way down until it gets to 60 seconds and then it'll cross over into bulb. Now we're not using bulb tonight uh, or live time, which is the next click, but we are gonna be using live composite. Now you will see that it's gone very, very dark. So I'm just gonna rotate it back into live time so that I can see what I'm doing. You can see my shadow there because I've got a little bit of light behind me. Now, here's some magic settings if you wanna do light painting outside. You wanna press okay for your super control panel. Go and set your ISO at 200. Make sure that you're shooting in your preferred file format. I'm shooting in RAW tonight. Let's switch off face detect because we don't need any of that. And let's make sure that we're in autofocus because I'm going to use a torch to pre-light things to focus on them. Now, live composite works in a very special way by stacking shorter uh, exposures over a longer period of time. So if I go back into live composite and then press the menu button, this is where I'm going to input that exposure time. Okay, so this is a base exposure that it's going to stack on top of each other. And again, my magic formula here is going to be about half a second. So your total live composite setting should be half a second in composite F8 for depth of field uh, and ISO 200 ready to go. Let's go back to live time so that we can compose. Have a look at our image. Make sure everything is where we want it to be. Sadly, we can't get any further back today because we're very close to the road, as you can hear. Uh, but that should just about do us now. And I can look at the cottage now and figure out that uh, over there is my end point. So I'm not going to walk any further than that. And over there is my other end point. So I'm not going to walk any further than that. Okay. So let's get right back to it. And you should see a sped up version uh, of everything that's going to happen right now. Well, there we go. All festive and lovely for Christmas. Now I'm gonna head on inside, but I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now and stay safe. <laughs>